Welcome to another episode of Camp at Home. Speaking of home, today we're going to talk about another word for home, which is habitat. A habitat is an area that a plant or animal makes its home in. This includes the food, water, shelter, and the space required to sustain that living thing. Today we're going to talk about some of the habitats found here at camp, both big and small. We have many different habitat types at Camp Widewater, from thick woodlands to open grasslands. We accommodate all sorts of wildlife here at camp. One type of animal that calls this forest home is a wild turkey. Turkeys roost in the trees in groups called rafters. That is their shelter. They forage for fruits, nuts, and grains under the trees. We also have Widewater Creek, which um, right at the bottom of this ravine, which provides them with lots of fresh water. Of course, as many of you know, we have lots of room here at camp for the turkeys to roam. Out behind the archery range, there's a very unique ecosystem known as the Oak Openings region. Um, this ecosystem was formed a long time ago when Lake Warren was around, which was um, Lake Erie when it was three times as large as it is today. That made this area the sandy shores of Lake Warren. And when the water receded, it left behind sand. And this sand formed dunes, which allowed for many different types of eco small micro ecosystems to form. Um, at the top of these dunes, we can find desert species, such as the prickly pear cactus. And um, not far away, sometimes only feet, we can find wetland species right next to it, uh, such as the pin oak. This really unique setup allows for many different types of animals to live and call this place home. In fact, the Nature Conservancy ranks the Oak Openings region on par with the Florida Everglades when it comes to biodiversity. Pretty cool. Now we are going to explore the habitat of the wild camper. Here at Harmony Lodge, we have everything a camper could need from a nice, warm, comfy bed to lay their head on at the end of the day and rest after a day full of activities we have wardrobes for them to put their things in. Plenty of space. Lots of space to roam. And of course, plenty of food assembled right here in our very own wide water kitchen. As you can see, God provides a home for everyone here at camp. 